Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. So today in this lecture, we will discuss about secondary sexual characters. Okay. So you have learned that in reproduction chapter, the testes and ovaries, testes and ovaries are the male and female reproductive system reproductive reproductive organs respectively okay so they produce gametes they produce gametes that is sperm and ova that is sperm and ova okay so in girls in girls breast begin to develop at puberty begin to develop at puberty similarly in boys and boys begin to grow facial hair facial hair like moustaches and beard so these are the changes as these features help to as these features help to distinguish distinguish the male from the female they are called as sexual secondary sexual characteristics okay so now we will discuss about role of hormones role of hormones in initiating reproductive function in initiating reproductive function okay students so endocrine glands releases hormones into the blood stream to reach a particular body called target site the target site respond to the so let me first tell you what are endocrine glands and what are pituitary glands okay so the students have you heard of the changes which occur at adolescence let me tell you what hormones are the changes which occur at adolescence are controlled by are controlled by hormones so and the hormones are chemical substances these are secretion from endocrine glands hormones are chemical substances these are secretion from endocrine glands okay or endocrine system the male hormone or testosterone so let me first raise this so the male hormone the male hormone and testosterone begins to released by the testes 
begins to released by the testis at onset of puberty okay this causes changes in boys about which you have just learned okay once puberty reached in girls so once puberty reached in girls ovaries begin to produce female hormone or estrogen ovaries begins to produce female hormone or estrogen okay students which makes the which makes the breast develop so these are the hormones so now let's come to roles of hormones in initiating reproductive functions so the endocrine glands releases hormones so now discuss i am discussing about the role of hormones in initiating reproductive functions so endocrine glands endocrine glands release hormones release hormones into the blood stream into the blood stream so this blood stream to reach a particular body part called target site so the target site responds to the hormone there are mainly endocrine glands or ductless glands in the body okay so when the testis and the ovaries secrete sex hormones they are responsible for the secondary sexual characteristics which we have discussed just now so further the sex hormones are under the controls of hormones from the pituitary glands okay the now let me draw a diagram first so student this is the diagram which is showing here that when hormones from pituitary stimulate testes and ovaries to release testosterone in male and estrogen in female this hormones released in blood stream and reaches body parts means or the target sites so this stimulate changes in the body of boys and girls at the onset of puberty so this is what was called as secondary sexual characteristics characters okay so student so i hope that you have learned secondary sexual characters which we have discussed and if you have still any doubt or any question based on this then please do let me know in the comment section i will be happy to help you guys there thank you happy learning